New tonight, the state's only rainbow trout aquaponics farm is shutting down at the end of the year. The owner says the pandemic, inflation and massive power outage earlier this year has made it too difficult for them to stay afloat. Our Chelsea Davis reports. John Dobelvin opens his smoker at Kula Haven Farms. That's 120 trout fillets smoking away. And it sure smells delicious. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> I've had numerous people tell me it's the best food they've ever eaten in their lives. And I tend to agree. His farm is the first and only of its kind in the state. We have a special permit uh, from the state of Hawaii to import rainbow trout eggs. And we bring in about 2,000 eggs a month hatch them in our hatchery and grow them out over the course of about 11 months to a one pound rainbow trout. Every Wednesday, they get their orders from the restaurants and retail outlets and get the trout ready to be sent out. You can find his fresh fish at Maui Food Hub, Upcountry Farmers Market, Pukalani Superette, Tamura's, and at fine restaurants like world renowned Mama's Fish House and Miramins. We got lots of restaurants that, that want our trout. We just were too small an operation right now to meet the market. He also harvests about 2,000 pounds of organic watercress a month. It's one of the top four leafy greens you can eat. It's packed with vitamin A and vitamin C. Vitamin K is off the charts. But this is all coming to a halt. His final harvest is on December 23rd. His final delivery, Christmas Eve. We actually got hit with a double whammy. We were way behind on, on electricity and rent because of the pandemic. And as I said, we got almost no support at all. Um, and then last, uh, last August, we had a really bad island-wide power outage, and we couldn't get our generator running in time. We lost all of our small fish and all of our big fish. And so we had no income for a couple of months, and at that point, the landlord terminated our lease. But he's optimistic he will find farmland to expand his business. So I'm really um, deeply concerned about growing enough food for Hawaii's people. And this is one of the ways we can do it. We can't do it all, but we can be a big part of the, of the solution. He just needs a like-minded business partner and the capital. In Kula, Chelsea Davis, Hawaii News Now.